Hi, good morning. <laughs> Welcome back to Summit Sunrise Live. I am here with Tim. Good morning, Tim. Good morning to you. How are you doing today? I'm doing great, you know. It'd be nice if it was a little bit colder out, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, cold. if there was a bit more snow. I don't know, though. I like, I, I'm going to be honest, I like the sun. <laughs> So <laughs> I'm fine with that. Um, so you're joining us from Sauce on the Blue, great little Italian restaurant here in Silverthorne. Um, so how long has the restaurant been around? Tell us a bit about its backstory. We're about a year and three months old. We opened in December of 17, eight, 16, excuse me. Wow. Yeah. yeah Losing a year, year already. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Um, so it's going really well. Then, it's going really you've got great, yeah. another location as well, right? Well, we've got a couple of locations. We have Sauce on the Blue oh. in Silverthorne. Sauce in the Maggie, which is near the Maggie Pond in Breckenridge. Mm -hmm. We have Quandry Grill over in Breck too, nice. which has been a you know happy hour staple in the county. Yeah, I've, I've definitely been there a lot. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you a lot for of happy that. happy hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we have course. Ink Spot Cafe over in Keystone. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, the coffee bar. The coffee bar, yeah. Same. Coffee wine bar now. We've actually put a Cuvenet system in there this week. Oh, a Cuvenet so system. Yeah. So what is that, if you didn't know? <laughs> so that is a wine preservation system. We actually have one at Sauce in the Blue, and we bought mm -hmm. a, a matching one to put over there. The difference with the one in Ink Spot, it's self-service, so you buy a card, and then you go oh, okay. up and you can um, purchase whatever wine you want, and if you don't drink it all in one day, you can go back over the course of a week, a year. Oh, really? So it's really a nice kind of concept. We oh, have so cool. eight bottles in there that are kept at an optimum temperature and the optimum, you know, they don't go bad because of the argon gas that's in there. So mm -hmm. it's a really cool, it's a cool idea for people, out, you know, after skiing. Yeah, definitely. So it, it's like one of those where you get like three different uh, size samples. So yeah. You can uh, just, just buy, a, how, do, how does it work then? You just buy a card and... You buy a card at the register and then you go over to the machine and you basically get a glass there and you can have a one ounce sampler. You can have a three ounce glass or a six ounce mm -hmm. glass. Makes it a nice way. That does it. I've, I've done that in New Zealand. I haven't done that anywhere here yet. But um, yeah, that was definitely a fun afternoon. Yeah. So, <laughs> very cool. Um, okay, so do you, um, what, uh, what else is great about uh, Sauce on the Blue? You have happy hours, is that pretty popular? Yeah, we have happy hour every day that starts at three o'clock for, three o'clock to 5.30 for food. We do half price small pizzas, $5 apps, and of course dollar off drinks. And the drinks last till six o'clock every night. Oh. Wow. Uh, what are the most, what are some of the most popular apps? The, the Brussels sprouts are probably the best selling thing yeah. on the menu. You'd think that no one likes Brussels sprouts. I, I, personally, I don't. <laughs> well, you have so to what, come and try yeah, ours. Yeah. Okay. So what, what, how, do, how are they prepared? Like what would make me love yeah. them? <laughs> well, you fry most things and so okay. they can taste better. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> the balsamic glaze on top makes a big difference. Oh, beautiful. And of course it's in the oil that, that cooks all the rest of our food. So yeah. it kind of does add a little love to it as we like to say. Very nice. Okay, so can you tell us a bit about the menu? Uh, what kind of things are on Well, we have family style Italian dishes. We have the traditional pastas, the traditional chicken parms, marsalas, but we also have steak specials, fish specials, and ravioli specials every night that change, mm -hmm. um, depending on what Chef Dan comes up with particular nights. So we've got some, some, great, some great apps that come up and some great yeah. um, nightly specials, especially our fish specials. Where you've got I think there's got eight items that are fish specials on oh, the menu. Wow. On a okay, that would, def that would definitely be nice. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, really nice. Is it similar menus at uh, the other locations yeah. as well? Kind of well, Sauce in the Maggie and Sauce in the Blue are yeah, the same right. location. Sorry. The specials change because okay. our chef over there will, will create something different for that restaurant that night while our chef here will create something different as well. Oh, okay, so you always get something unique, changed every day. That's, yes, exactly. That's wonderful. Uh, are there any, what about like any dietary restrictions? We, we actually have gluten-free like items that? on the menu, a ton of them. We have um, zucchini noodles, which we use in all our pasta dishes. Oh, yum. Okay. So that's, you know, a lot of people like that. People are, you know, gluten's a thing now, so. It, it's, it's the thing to be removed. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah, yeah. And we have um, gluten-free pasta and we have gluten-free pizza, which oh, is nice. Oh, yum. Okay, any, any vegan options? Um, there's plenty of vegan okay. options, yeah. Oh, good to you know. We can control most things. We can yeah. actually, you know, change the menu. Since everything's cooked to order, um, oh. you know, we're able to, to make those, those changes. Yeah. Oh, wonderful. So do you have any, um, events coming up? Anything, any specials? Well, we have our wine dinner the first Tuesday of each month. So okay. next month, it's already December. We're talking about December already. I know, I know. We were talking about the lighting of the tree and like Santa coming. And I thought, hang on, it was, it was, it was, my, it was Halloween last week. <laughs> yes, it Wasn't was. It? What's happened? <laughs> so we're doing Ronaldo Roddy this month, which is a, just killer Barolos. Okay. So that dinner is December 5th. It's $150 per person. Okay. So it's a five course meal. There's like six types of wine that you'll have that night. All Barolas for the most part. There'll be one Nebbiola. And this is um, a pretty incredible wine dinner. We yeah. do these each month. This is our Christmas one, which we always tend to go okay. a little bit further out. Nice. Chef Dan always does a couple things different for it. So it's, um, if you haven't been to one of these, it's, it's an incredible night. We have yeah. a lot of fun. 
Yeah, what sort of things have happened in the past? Like, what can people expect? Um, well, this month we're definitely going to have lobster raviolis or, or, or lobster risotto, excuse me. Oh, yum. Okay. That was cool. so, it was so well received last I month. Bet. We brought it back. <laughs> I can imagine. And, and we always do fillets. We, this month we're going to have um, prime, prime rib, I think it is. Or not prime rib, excuse me. We're having um, slow cooked braised short ribs. Oh, yum. Okay, so. cool. So that's the 5th of December. Why don't you do it every Tuesday? Of, we, the, the, the first Tuesday of each month. Sorry. And all you have to do is call the restaurant at 970-468-7488 to make a reservation. We do it all reservations ahead of time okay. so we know how much wine to order and how much food to prepare. Good to know. Is there also a website or is the phone number the best way? Um, you can also go on the website, which is sauce on the blue at sauceontheblue.com or quandrygrill.com, sauceonthemaggie.com or inkspot.com. Wow. Lots of options there. There you go. <laughs> Very cool. Oh, that sounds so uh, festive. I can't wait. Um, I will be there on the 5th. Uh, Tim, thank you so much for well, coming in and joining us. That was uh, Sauce on the Blue, great little Italian restaurant in Silverthorne. Uh, we'll be right back after these adverts with more information.